Hi friend! Let's look at how to change the color of a symbol. First, when you find the symbol, click on the image rather than dragging it to the tray. This will take you to the image page. Here you can see other styles and colors of the image. Let's say I need a vanilla cupcake with purple frosting. Yum! Let's change the colors. Click on the Recolor and Customize button. Here you will find many ways to customize the image. Let's take a look starting with recoloring. Scrolling down I can see all the colors in the image. If I want to recolor the icing to be purple, I can click on the area to change. Notice the color palette on the corresponding color. The icing right now is a creamy color. I will adjust it to purple. Then click Swap Colors. I can do the same to change the chocolate cake to a vanilla cake. This is what I need and I can click Save Custom Symbol. There you go. Let's see what else we can do. This slider groups similar colors. If I slide the slider to the left, I can change some colors together. For example, I see three pinks, two in the paper cup and one on the sprinkles. I can slide the slider and then change all the pinks to a purple. Some symbols have many, many shades of color and it helps to change them all at one time. Above the Swap Color section, I can also change the outline from black to any color and change the thickness. Good thing I can always click Undo It. This works. For students with visual impairments, I can convert the symbols to high contrast. I can play with the image until it meets the needs of my students. The last feature on the left side of the page is adding a background. Maybe I will go back to my purple cupcake and add a blue background. Under the symbol, you can find ways to rotate or flip the image. and you can add overlays on top. When I am done, I click the Save Custom Symbol and then drag it to the tray. If I need, I can click the back button to make additional changes. If I need these customized symbols later, they are found under the Your Lesson Picks tab, and then scroll down to Your Photos and Custom Symbols. They will also appear in search results. The green flag shows these are custom symbols, but this flag does not show when you create a material. Ta-da! Lesson Picks. Custom visuals at your fingertips.